I'd like to recommend one of the latest 60 Symbols videos in which Professor Moriarty addresses the annoying phenomenon of quantum woo. I'll leave a link to that, and I'd like to show you one of the most pernicious incarnations of quantum woo, which is the secret. The essence of the secret is this bullshit called the law of attraction. This idea essentially says that whatever you think about becomes real. When you focus on the things that you don't want, I don't want to be late, I don't want to be late. You really are calling that into existence. The law of attraction doesn't hear that you don't want it, and so it's gonna show up over and over and over again. Now, of course, this is obviously bullshit, because if it were real, then every teenage boy would be getting more sex than Caligula. But supposedly, this phenomenon is the result of quantum mechanics. Quantum physics really begins to point to this discovery. It says that you can't have a universe without mind entering into it, that the mind is actually shaping the very thing that is being perceived. Well, let's say the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics is true, and the act of observing a particle is what causes it to manifest itself in a particular location. I don't think that's right, but let's say that it is. How do you get from the idea that observation causes particles to manifest themselves in a particular location to the idea that the universe reads your mind and makes your thoughts become real? I don't see how the latter logically follows from the former. There's certainly nothing about quantum physics that says that. There is absolutely nothing in quantum theory that says that thinking about something really hard will make it real. Even if you buy the interpretations of quantum mechanics that say that observation plays a role in creating reality, not a single one of them says that reality will make your wishes come true. None of them say that you can just get reality to do whatever you want by willing it so. And the funniest thing about the idiots in The Secret is that I don't think even they understand how this is supposed to work. Now, if you don't understand it, doesn't mean you should reject it. So if it doesn't make sense, believe it anyway. You don't understand electricity, probably. First of all, no one even knows what electricity is. And yet you enjoy the benefits of it. Uh...